only time I get any good sleep anymore is when I go in for some sort of surgery. <laughs> you know? Most people dread that, you know? I'm up to like one colonoscopy a month. I, I, I say, uh, <laughs> take daddy to the happy place. I know. <laughs> I'm going to get a couple of good hours of shut-eye there, so... <laughs> So my wife and I now, this year, uh... <laughs> he's Central Indiana's homegrown comedian, and he's come full circle. On May 6th and 7th, he will be appearing at Crackers Comedy Club, the stage where his career began many years ago. He's also attempting to break his own world record in Carmel this month. Please welcome an all-Indiana favorite, Dave Dugan. George, Randall, good to be here. Yeah, of course, Thanks. of course. So where, where do we stand now on you doing comedy clubs? Uh, well, most of the stuff I do these days, the schedule's pretty filled with more like corporate and mm -hmm. private and fundraisers and conventions and stuff, but I still do a handful of, of club dates, yeah. like the one at Crackers this week. So Awesome. Uh, now, that club atmosphere, what does that mean to you? It's a little more intimate, you know, for, for comedians? Yeah, I like what it. Does that mean it's to you? a little more loose. I mean, like, uh, I still relatively do a clean show even in a comedy club, but, you know, it, it doesn't mean we might not venture out into some human wheelbarrows or, uh, uh, you know, a, a adult leapfrog. I mean, it's pretty... <laughs> Uh, pretty loose compared to the the corporate stuff, but yeah. uh, but this particular uh, week is kind of Crackers is kind of close to my heart since that's where I started. And mm -hmm. uh, Ruth Ann uh, Herber has been running the club for about uh, 25 years, and yeah. and so uh, you know I feel like I want to make it special because it's their anniversary, and mm -hmm. and it's kind of an anniversary for me. I might be the only one that cares about that, <laughs> but uh, <laughs> so I don't know if I'm going to do it big. You know, come on stage Friday night, uh, you know, on a zip line with. <laughs> you know, fireworks lit, and lit, just lit, lit sparklers in my mouth. Yeah, <laughs> I'll probably just go on stage and say, "How y'all doing?" Yeah, uh, but uh, yeah, no, I'm looking forward to it. It's really good to get to get back there. Awesome. So, so it'll have a homecoming vibe for you. That's yeah, awesome. a little bit. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Now, okay, you also sell yourself as an imposter. What, what, what do you mean when you say that, as an imposter? Oh, you've been reading the old website. Yeah, there, right there. Let's do a little <laughs> <Okay>. research. <laughs> yeah, because that, that goes back to the corporate stuff. And mm -hmm. sometimes a company will uh, hire me not just to, you know, enter entertain all their folks that are there, but to uh, be introduced as somebody that I'm not, like a... <laughs> like a, a, a new hire with the company or a, a consultant or, you know, maybe even uh, maybe even the brother-in-law's, uh, uh, you know, uh, or like a brother-in-law to the CEO or something <laughs> like that. Uh, those have all kind of happened. And, and, you know, that's kind of a fun way to start. I mean, people, yeah. uh, you know, sometimes are squirming a little bit because they, they, <laughs> they don't know it's it's uh, that they're being put on for a while. But then, then you just switch gears and do your show. But Oh, that's uh, funny. I know fun. we that's would be remiss if we did not ask you about you, you set a world record in 2018 driving in circles <laughs> hundreds of times. Yeah, don't tell uh, me I'm not a winner. Yeah, so now, so, um, and, and we're going to go beyond now. Yeah, I'm, I'm hoping to break my, my record. And uh, uh, back in 2018, um, I had wanted to do something for, uh, for a cancer uh, organization for quite some time. And as I started putting this idea for maybe doing a, a roundabout thing, just because I'm from Carmel and I've been making jokes about roundabouts for quite a while, it just yeah. seems somewhat natural. But uh, together, I met the CEO CEO of uh, Cancer Support Community, Eric Richards, and okay. he was really enthused about it. So uh, that first year we did it, I, I ended up doing uh, 717 laps, I guess. Wow. And, uh, and didn't even uh, get dizzy. Um, which I get me dizzy false. off of two. Like yeah. I, I'm, I'm following the GPS, and I'll get dizzy <laughs> for two laps. It, it gave me false confidence that I might be a candidate for the space program. But um, <laughs> so yeah, so this time I'm going to try to beat it. Um, uh, maybe go for even an even thousand, and you know, month of May. That's a good time yeah. to be with a, good with time a, to ride in circles. Good Definitely time to go in circles. So and how how much time does that take to go to take that many laps? You know, I'm not sure because last time I went a little over. Uh, it, it didn't take much over three hours and uh -huh. 15 minutes or so, so I'm not sure how, how long it'll take this time to, to do that. But, uh, um, you know, I'm not, I'm, not, uh, I'm not really nervous about it because I do a lot of long drives. Uh, uh, like, you know, t uh, my son lives on the East Coast, so I do a lot of long drives to him. And I've got this down now where I can just do, like, one stop in a 10-hour drive, like uh, uh, one stop to... Get some gas. Uh, and you and, you and I both live in Carmel, so, so we go through 27 traffic <laughs> right. circles just to get to the grocery store. Yeah. Right? Sure. Yeah. But, yeah. Well, if you so, see, if you see uh, Dave guys riding around in circles, he's not lost. He's he's just you know 
it's stuff a from quest. the cross. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I did find out it's hard on the tires, though, so yeah. I may go in reverse a few times just to even out the tread. <laughs> okay, p uh, plug, plug the weekend. Oh, the yeah. weekend? Okay, yeah. that'd be at Crackers Comedy Club mm -hmm. on the uh, uh, Friday and Saturday of this week. And uh, you can get your tickets on their website or by giving them a call at uh, the Crackers Reservation Desk. And so, uh, yeah, it's, it's going to be two shows, 8 o'clock both night and uh, both nights. Uh, sometimes I don't like to do plurals. <laughs> and uh, it's just a, just a thing I'm going through. Awesome. And so, yeah. But thank you guys for, yeah, for yeah. having me on. Yeah, check Dave out if, at uh, Crackers, guys. Check him no, out. No, maybe you're not done with me. I didn't mean to, I didn't mean to cut us off so bad. No, no, no. I think, I think we're, we're, yeah. right on, we're right on we're time. Right on I, time. I usually can tell when people have had enough. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> The band didn't start playing yet. You're good. No. <laughs> Thanks, George. You got it.